is uh, work on some angles. And what we have is we have two intersecting lines. And with these two intersecting lines, uh, what has been given to us is uh, some, uh, some angle that we need to kind of determine what the relationship is. So when we have two intersecting lines, um, one thing we look at is I can, sh I can represent that these two opposite angles are equal to each other because they're called, we'll called vertical angles. Um, and these two angles are also going to be equal to each other. Their opposite angles are going to be vertical angles. And I represent them equally to each other by this single tick mark here and the single tick mark here. These two are equal, and I'll show that because these both have you know, double tick marks. Now, brings us to, to our problem, is if they were equal to each other, then I could simply write an equation, 2x equals 4x plus 108. And the reason why I said an equation, the question, the problem on this board is asking us to find the value of x. So to find the value of x, I'm going to have to be solving for x, which is going to tell me I'm going to want to set some type of equation up. However, I can't set these equal to each other because these two angles are not equal. You can obviously tell this is an uh, acute angle and this is an obtuse angle. So I need some other kind of reference uh, that I can use to solve for these, solve for x in these two problems. There's some way I can represent these two expressions. Well, one thing that we, uh, we know um, and that we're you know, learning in our book is a straight line is 180 degrees. And if you look at these two lines, I'm sorry, these two angles, when they are combined together, they make up a straight line. So therefore, I can say now 2x plus 4x plus 108, which is this angle plus this angle, equals 180. So I can write that without the parentheses, 2x plus 4x plus 108 equals 180. Now, I can combine my like terms, 6x plus 108 equals 180. Subtract the 108, I get 6x is equal to, uh, let's see, 72. Then, I divide by 6, and I get x is, uh, is going to equal 12. So therefore, the value of x for this problem is going to be 12. And remember, there's a couple things to remember. When you have opposite angles, they're called vertical angles, and they're going to equal each other. And these two angles, when they add up to 180 or make a straight line, we call them supplementary angles. And so we get, we'll just write um, an, equ an equation for both those angles added up equals 180, and then solve using our algebra skills.